Representations of Rational Functions, Quarter 1, Module 7. Construct a table of values of the following functions using the interval of negative 3 to positive 3. Sketch the graph. First, f of x is equal to x plus 2 all over x minus 2. Second, g of x is equal to 3x over x squared minus 4. Number 1, f of x is equal to x plus 2 all over x minus 2. Since the given interval is from negative 3 to positive 3, let us now create a table of values. So in the first column, we will write the x and y variables. In the first row, we will now write the given interval. Since the values of x are from negative 3 to positive 3, so we have negative 3, negative 2, negative 1, 0, 1, 2, and positive 3. To find the value of y, we will now substitute the value of x to the given function. So let us start if x is equal to negative 3. So we will substitute the value of x. So we have f of negative 3. After that, we simplify. Then we have f of negative 3 is equal to 1 over 5. If x is equal to negative 2, so substitute, then simplify, then we have f of negative 2 is equal to 0. If x is equal to negative 1, substitute, simplify, then we have f of negative 1 is equal to negative 1 over 3. If x is equal to 0, so Substitute, then simplify, then we have f of 0 is equal to negative 1. If x is equal to 1, substitute, simplify, then f of 1 is equal to negative 3. If x is equal to 2, substitute, then simplify. You have observed that f of 2 is undefined because any number divided by 0, that is undefined. So we can also write it as u and d. It means that is undefined. The value of y is undefined when x is equal to 2. If x is equal to 3, substitute, simplify, then we have f of 3 is equal to 5. Now, let us now sketch the graph of f of x is equal to x plus 2 all over x minus 2 using the table of values. The first thing that we need to do is to check in which value of x that will make our function undefined. So you have observed if x is equal to 2, y or f of x is not defined. So we are now going to draw a broken line, a straight vertical line, if x is equal to 2. Then we are now going to plot the remaining points. So let us start with negative 3 and 1 fifth. Then we have negative 2 and 0, negative 1 and negative 1 third, 0 and negative 1. 1 and negative 3. Then we also have 3 and positive 5. Now, let us now connect the points in the left side of our broken line. You have observed that the graph is going down. Therefore, the opposite side of our broken line must be the opposite direction of the graph in the left side. So we have the graph in the right side of our broken line is going up. Number 2, g of x is equal to 3x over x squared minus 4. Since a given interval is from negative 3 to positive 3, so let us now create a table of values 
then we have x and y, then in x we have negative 3, negative 2, negative 1, 0, 1, 2, and 3. To find the value of y, we will now substitute the value of x to the given function. So we have g of negative 3, so we substitute the value of x, then simplify. So we have g of negative 3 is equal to negative 9 over 5. If x is equal to negative 2, substitute, simplify. So g of negative 2 is equal to undefined. So you have observed that the denominator is 0. So therefore, if x is equal to negative 2, y is not defined. Then, if x is equal to negative 1, substitute, simplify, then we have g of negative 1 is equal to 1. If x is equal to 0, substitute, simplify, then g of 0 is equal to 0. If x is equal to 1, substitute, simplify, then g of 1 is equal to negative 1. If x is equal to 2, substitute, simplify, then g of 2 is undefined. You have observed that the denominator is 0, so it means that g of 2 is not defined. If x is equal to 3, substitute, simplify, then g of 3 is equal to 9 over 5. Let us now sketch the graph of g of x is equal to 3x over x squared minus 4 using the table of values. So the first thing that we need to do is we need to identify in which value or values of x that will make our function undefined. So you have observed that there are two values of x. The first one, if x is equal to negative 2, the value of y is undefined. So we're going to sketch this. So we're now going to draw a straight or a vertical line, a broken line. If x is equal to negative 2. Then, the other one, we have if x is equal to 2, the value of y is also undefined. So, we are now going to draw a broken line. Then, after that, we are going to plot all the remaining points. So, let us start with negative 3 and negative 9 over 5. We have also negative 1 and positive 1. Then we have 0 and 0, 1 and negative 1, 3 and 9 over 5. Then this is now the graph of g of x.